Oh, let's look at this nice triangle, A, B, C. Oh, then, oh, oh, looks like angle bisector right there. So this angle, this angle is the same. So whatever angle is, uh, this one is, so we separate this one in right in half. Okay, so now uh, I'm going to call this one D. Okay, then you can see AB is 9 inches long. Then segment AC is 7 inches. Then 11 inches on BC. So 11 inches. Now, uh, if I put this angle bisector right there, so AD, then uh, we are looking for the length of BD. How about that? Oh, let's say this one is X, okay? Then, oh, what about Y? Right there, I'm going to call this one Y. Oh, doesn't matter. So total is 11, so if I know X, so I can find out Y, right? Okay, easily. Okay, two different ways we're going to study on geometry, okay? Sometimes so we know the theory and theorem and uh, everything, okay, principles and everything. Then we find uh, uh, the length, whatever, uh, the question, right? But in this case, I want you to study this one this way first. Then later we find out the proof, okay, later, okay? Not proof first, okay? So we're going to find out this one, okay? X equals, ooh, very simple. So x equals total was 11, 11. Now times, see? Now, oh, oh. So we separate x and y by this ratio right there. See, this ratio means 9 and 7. See, 9 and 7. Oh, that means left-hand side, there's going to be 9 out of total. What is the total? That's right, 9 and 7, which is 16. That's it, see? Okay, how about y? y equals 11 times, okay, 7 out of 16, 7 out of 16. See, they separate this length by this ratio. Very simple. So, 99, this one, is all you have to do what? You just calculate this, okay, 99 divided by 16, right? Ooh, that's it. What about this one? 77 divided by 16, see? Okay, you can use the calculator or whatever. You can uh, find out this answer, right? So I call this one, that's right, angle bisector. <laughs> bisector. That's it.